We are Sean, Emma, Rex and Maggie and in this series we head on a tour of South West Scotland in Rennie, our motorhome. In this episode we show you around the Drumlan Rig Castle Estate and give you a mini tour of a family run campsite just down the road. So it's finally stopped raining. Um, we made it up to our new little campsite, little farm campsite called Oak Bank. Um, it's not far from the castle that we're going to try and go to either tomorrow or the next day depending on the weather. Um, and there's mountain biking at this castle as well believe it or not so we're going to check that out too. So yeah it's a nice little site. I think it's about 10 pitches. Maybe a couple more. Electric hookup. Hard standing. It's quite nice. Um, we've got some showers and toilets here. Little block. And showers are just there. Toilets as well in there. And then round here, oops, please. we come through here to the tent field, which is quite cool. I think that's the tent field up there. That, that bit there and then down here I'm just gonna watch my footing there's a lovely little dog walk so it's all enclosed all the way around all the way down the bottom there and there's their resident goose um, and all the way up the top here and they've even put a little poo bin box so that's pretty cool as well. So, hello Goose. Hello. <laughs> you can see him right the way down there. He's on his own. What oh, he's doing, or oh, she's on her own. Yeah, it's a nice little spot. It's obviously a working farm as well, so the cows in the distance. Yeah, it's a nice little spot. We've booked him for a couple of nights. Um, just because the weather wasn't gonna be very good over the weekend and we wanted to make sure that we were fully charged and everything so yeah so we're all booked in charging everything up say hello to rex rex hello you all right <laughs> there's the <laughs> sean okay oh and there's momo on the table though she shouldn't be yeah so yeah, so we've booked in, I think it was 22 quid a night here. Nice view of the hills as well. Yeah, it's a nice little site. Hopefully tomorrow the weather will be a bit better and we can get out and about. I went to Aldi and picked up some of these little um, bed fleecy things for the pups because they're really cheap in there. And Rex loves them, don't you Rex? What are you doing under there? Comfy. He's like night night. Got himself in. He probably loves them. You're not bothered, are you, me? You happy down there? It's under the bed. Yeah, Mo, Mo, do you want it? Are you missing out, Rex? Are you missing out? Oh, you got yourself stuck, haven't you? you got yourself stuck. What are you doing? <laughs> Morning, everyone. Morning. <laughs> We've come today to Drumland Rig Castle to have a little wander around the grounds. The castle's not actually open today, so we're just having a wander through the forest and checking out what the mount deal on the mountain bike routes are before we come back tomorrow. Yeah.
Where are you going, Em? Shower. <laughs> you have the force. <laughs> Morning. Morning. <laughs> so we've come up to Drumlanrae Castle uh, to go mountain biking, and it's pissing down with the rain. <laughs> it is, yeah. I've got my. I'm trying out my new wet weather shorts today, so we'll see how they get on. But yeah, as you can probably hear, it's uh, yeah, Not it's just nice. started raining. So, mm, but we've been lucky with the mountain biking so far. It's not had, we haven't had much rain. So, and we're going to Kira Tree again on Wednesday and it looks like full sunshine. So fingers crossed, it'll be okay there. I think I'm going to just wait it out in here. And I don't blame you. Take the dogs out in a bit. <laughs> I'd put the kettle on if I were you and have I'm a cup of coffee. To. I'll go and turn the gas to. on. Thank you. <laughs> so I've made it out with the dogs. Um, yesterday we did a little walk the purple route which is a couple of kilometers not very far at all and today uh, I'm going to take the dogs on a 4k walk so again not that long but with the weather being as it is um, I don't really want to get caught in it too much so the sun's out at the moment whether it will last who knows Sean's gone off to take on the red and the black I think it is here mountain bike routes um, and I hope the weather holds out. It's quite muddy underfoot, so I would imagine it's gonna be, he's gonna be filthy when he gets back, but we'll see. Anyway, um, currently taking me through the same bit of forest that um, we did yesterday. So I'll um, show you anything new that we didn't see yesterday later on. Castle is part of the Queensbury estate with 90,000 acres of countryside. There are several marked walking trails that follow original paths built in the Victorian era. These walks take you past several places of interest including small locks, stone bridges, and the beautiful Leaping Arch. The estate is rich in wildlife including red squirrels, tawny and barn owls, the tiny goldcrest, kingfisher and otters plus some rare and elusive wildflowers and plants. So there is plenty to keep nature lovers and active visitors engaged along with a tea room and a gift shop. Also dogs on leads are welcome in the grounds but not in the castle itself. I'm going to take on the red and black. So it's the red with the black sections. And it's 20k all round. So that's 12 miles. Sun's out. So uh, here we go.
all right yeah good yeah I enjoyed that it was um, greasy greasy roots everywhere I think I must have said greasy roots a hundred times on the video I was just slip sliding everywhere and there's a lot of leaves on the roots and it's all yeah. wet and it's there's not a lot of rocks so you, it is I think you can't... it's because there's a lot of broadleaf trees here which mm. is starting to lose they're starting to shed yeah. whereas the Scot Scottish Forestry Commission or seven stains places they're more pine yeah so they don't tend to lose their leaves as much no I'd agree yeah but I mean in the summer you could ride it really fast and it'd run really fast right. but I was just had to take my time be so careful. yeah just be careful but yeah I enjoyed it it was good down a few gears yeah, first climb so I'm gonna do the blue Sean's done the red this morning he said it's really greasy and wet and we've had some more rain so I won't be going quick but you'll get a flavour of what it's like for a beginner beautiful amazing even though it's still raining see that these could be really really nasty but actually even I can sort of give them a little roll over keep your pedals neutral so you don't ding them and there we go I'm just trying that going over these sort of things will build your confidence And again, you know, I said in the last video, I'm riding these blind, I've never been down them before, so I've got no idea what's coming up, so the apprehension... Ooh, pheasant. <laughs> now, these rollers look quite close together, so you just have to take it easy through these sections. Watch your pedals. That could be a jump there with a the hardcore and we're going up again so here we go okay, okay I'm going to take it easy 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 pedals nice and neutral Keep a little bit of speed, pick my line, and just, oh my giddy arm, go high, whoa, go high, <laughs> pedal, okay, make it easy, these are quite full on. weather mad crazy mad right which way oh up the road
Join us next time when we head to Kiratree Forest for a night off-grid under dark skies.